All right, all right. We back. It's your boy, D.C. Curry. God bless uh, the queen. God bless the princess. Queen dead. Queen dead. Oh, no. The queen now is... Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we talking about Queen Elizabeth. Gorilla the gorilla. Camilla. Camilla. How could you go from... Well... Uh, Prince uh, Philip. This is Diane. He was king. He was prince at that time. He's king now. Mm. From Diana. Diana was pretty beautiful. Woman. I think so. To Gorilla the Gorilla. Mm -hmm. Don't he got cancer? Yeah, he got cancer. And Kate Middleton got cancer. Yeah, mm -hmm. they both got cancer. They, uh, oh, which Kate is got where I was headed. Too? Yeah, yeah, yeah oh, she's got cancer. They diagnosed her as cancer. You know, she been in and out of the hospital and, mm -hmm. and uh, right. mm -hmm. playing games, putting on them fake pictures and stuff. Right. <laughs> You know, she like had yeah, her body and cookie head on it and all that kind yeah. of shit. Trying to say William Her she head and cookie stuff. body. <laughs> 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 but uh, she anyway, she finally revealed that she got uh, <laughs> she got some kind of counsel. Mm. Mm -hmm. You ain't see that? That's dominating the news. No. Yeah. DC, I've been filming. I think it's prostate. I mean, she got not prostate. She, I was gonna say, <laughs> oh, no. she got prostate, <laughs> prostate. cancer. Yeah, she definitely got it from Not him. prostate. Uh, <laughs> no, um, yeah, intestinal. I'm sorry. Intestinal. Uh, oh, okay. I'm sorry. She got no, prostate. intestinal. She intestinal. got it from him if it's prostate. I cancer. meant to say intestinal. I'm sorry. Gay yeah, militant. Sure? But, uh, and no, I feel intestinal. for it. I feel for it, you know. Yeah. I mean, uh, I lost a sister to cancer. Mm. I lost I've my had, auntie to cancer. I love my mother. I'm yeah, my, mother my biological dad died of cancer. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I lost yeah my, my grandfather dad died had cancer, cancer. My, uh, but he died of a heart attack. My father got cancer. Mm. He's 98. What? Yeah, but he's still kicking it, though. Yeah. My father's 98. Look at God. Look at God. Still Look kicking it. Look at God. Then you say he got an older brother, too, doesn't he? He got a brother, 102. Get out of here. <laughs> exactly. He ain't got no cancer, but... Uh, so you never. guys got to be some good people. Somebody. Did That's what I'm trying good. to tell you, is JJ. Yeah. yeah, I know you're a good person, DC. I, I am. I know it. I'm a good person. Yes. Look how you said. Say what, look how you said the way where you well, frowned up where you said. That means <laughs> if your dad is 98. That his, means you, his, his dad was 100, 102. Right. That means you're going to be sticking around here till about like 99, which is another no 30, 40 years right here. <laughs> Nigga, I'm going to live forever. So that means I'm going to be sitting here and I'm going to be like 83. They say you can't live, they say you <laughs> so can't live forever, but I'm going to die trying. Right. Yeah. I'm going to be right with you, D.C. We're we gonna be dying saying, trying. We're saying, we're saying, we're right. I ain't going no damn well. 83. I'm like everybody else, heaven. This and right. I believe in heaven. Heaven can wait. This race where my, there's no hate and no fear. I got a question <laughs> for you, Redman. I'm going to ask you since we on a little religious. Sure, thing. what we got? Hmm? What we got? I'm going to stump you now. I guess. I, I don't, don't know. I'm going to stump I don't, I don't, I don't claim to know it all, but I think hate I know something. to preach on the air. Okay, what we got? But I'm going to ask you. I'm going to ask Let's several go. of my buddies who are preachers here. Huh? I said, okay. I got your back. Let's go. If you believe John 3.16, y'all familiar with that? Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. For God so loved the world, he gave his only begotten son. Go ahead. Whoever believe in him. Believe in him. And who's believing him? Believe in him shall Go ahead. Have everlasting night and should not perish. What's up? But shall have. I said shall have everlasting night. Okay. That's criteria for getting into heaven. Right. What was the criteria for getting into heaven before Jesus came? Which was 198,000 years after Adam and Eve. Before Jesus came, yeah, I yeah, just want to make sure I'm clear. I mean, it was the, uh, Jesus came? There was 198 thousand years between Adam and Eve, right, and the coming of so, Jesus. So, so how could a nigga in those 198 thousand years get into heaven? He couldn't say he believed in Jesus because <laughs> Jesus hadn't come. Well. Jesus is in, is in the Old Testament as well as the New Testament. <laughs> Jesus on. had not come. Right. All right. Go ahead. You ask me, and I'm gonna tell you. If you if you ask me, I'm gonna tell you. He was in Jesus. Was in the Old, okay. Jesus in the Old Testament as well as the New Testament. That's why. How could you have the story of Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego when he says, "Lo, I see a fourth guy in the fire, and that looks like the Son of Man, also Jesus." All right. So. But if you're going by the Levitical practices of the Levitical priests, that means... What is Levitical? What are you talking about, Levitical? Let's, the the, the average have, person don't know what the hell you're talking about. <laughs> Listen, man, you can't, I can't... I'll try to skim it back, but when you look at Leviticus, you had the, the priests 
God gave you certain laws and everything to obey. And so the priests had to go in that were chosen by God, that by were chosen by God to go in a petition for you. And if you were not pure, they would tie a waist around you, a rope around your waist, and you would go in. And to know that the priest who was going in for the people of atonement, he would ring a bell. That's how they knew he was still alive. And he would go in, and he would do he would do his petition of sins, and, uh, and then you have your, your sin offering and blood offering, which is where the animals and everything came at. And those people did that, and the priest went in for them. And if the priest was not clean, then he would die. And if you didn't hit a bell, then they would pull him out of the cage because he wasn't pure. So that was the way of atonement be it, the way of atonement back then so says the old testament but jesus said i didn't Rev, come to i didn't come i didn't come to uh at, chase, the, risk, I came to fulfill at it. the risk of being anti-biblical anything that was just straight bush that's the truth <laughs> that's I'm the ask, truth i'm asking you you said before jesus got here if after the coming of jesus after the coming of jesus you said before now Listen to me, nigga. Okay, go ahead. What we after, got? The, after the arrival of Jesus on earth. Got you. It's in the Bible. Right. Whosoever believeth in Jesus shall not perish but have everlasting life. Okay. Right. That's how you get into heaven, believe in Jesus. No matter how. So now we're going to the New Testament. Testament. Okay, got gotcha. you. No, no, no. So I'm saying before Jesus came, Mm -hmm. What was the criteria for getting into heaven? You couldn't say you believe in Jesus because he hadn't come yet. So I'm asking you, before Jesus came, did everybody go to heaven or did everybody go to hell? So what, I what, just what, told what, you. What they he's saying, did, deep, hold on, Brian, 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 let me talk, let me talk. Come on, Brian, Sister JJ. Brian be getting hot, boy. So I should I, get hot well, because well, if you're going to sit there and try to hold on. Hold on, hold on. Don't sit there and hold on. Hold on, 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 hold on. Yeah. The priests were supposed to be pure. And through them going into the curtain to repent, off, um, offer the offerings for the people in their repentance. Right. If they were not pure, then they would die. So we were trusting, in, or not we, but they were trusting in the priests who were supposed to be holy to go and repent on behalf of them for their sins, which will allow them then to live righteously and have the passageway to heaven. Is that right? With the burnt That's what offices, it says. Yeah, with the burnt yeah. offerings, offerings and love offerings. Because offers, then yeah. God sacrifices. requested I'm burnt saying. offices and sacrifices. So what? I'm that's saying. how you were able to enter into the gates of heaven. I'm saying, the burnt and offers. I've asked several preachers this: if the way to get into heaven. Now, since the coming of Jesus is to believe in Jesus, what was the way to get into heaven? But that before? was the way. That Let was me the way. finish. Ahead, Let me finish. Before Jesus came, which science has proven was a hundred and ninety-eight thousand years. That was the way. That was the way through the burnt um, offerings, sacrifices, you know what I'm saying? and repentance. That was the way through the burnt burnt offerings. Offerings. And repentance. Let's keep it now, simple. What did you believe? Came, so you you couldn't have believed let's, in let's, Jesus. Let's keep, he let's hadn't keep, let's, come. Let's keep, let's keep it simple then, Sister J. The priests were the way. Jesus came because he's the high priest of out of all priests. And that's why he made the sacrifice. So not only he was the high priest, he was also the sacrificial offering that they made in all the animals. So, of course, well, he, like made I, the he made the sacrifice. He made the sacrifice so you don't have to burn offerings or sacrifice for lambs and for all your sins. That was and it. that was the way. Jesus came to put away with all of that because he was the sacrifice. Right. And there was no sense in just spilling all that blood and everything yeah. through all these but, constant but Brian, animals. But, Brian, you be getting mad, though. Because I, like, like, I, I, I don't like the fact that you like I don't give a shit about him getting mad. Well, well, one get thing mad. is, I don't, I, I'm a type of... say don't argue his word. When you know that word in your heart of hearts, you stand on what you know and then you keep it right. moving. You can't be I mad understand that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah. Don't go there. Because I, I, I know the word in my heart and I know that before Jesus came, 
in the God came in Jesus in the flesh, I know that this was the way. Sister Jay, and I got so you he on says, over I've come, you put away with that because now I am the sacrificial lamb. So you believe that God, you believe in Jesus, that God, that he is God's only son. begotten son. 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 So Jay. that's why now. So when people do that, you know, it should, and that's what makes, that's what gets me about pastors and ministers stuff because when people go to question, and I'm not talking about you, Brian, but when people go to question, you ain't they become angry nigga. and they become assertive <laughs> and right. they be like, rah, rah. Right, I'm right. like, wait a minute, Let, let, me, let me tell yeah, you. Whoa, 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 just, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm not talking about you. I'm not talking I'm not talking about you. Let me, let me, it, no, let me. And I did it because, <laughs> let me tell you why I just did it. Because I become assertive, not because y'all question me. I, I spent time in that. Is when you giggle and snicker. Now I'll be I'll play about a lot of things. I'll play about a lot of things. But when I'm talking about when I'm talking about God and y'all gonna question is a giggle, I don't find that funny. DC wasn't talk, giggling. I'm gonna talk to you. I don't give a shit I'm about your feelings, man. <laughs> I'm just saying, I, mean, I, just I, really, I don't give a shit about it. I mean, I get it, y'all are touch. I just said I can tell I'm 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 you sensitive I'm about a giggling. Christian. I, I just don't, don't like when people laugh about it. I'm with you on that. I mean, we're not y'all laughing at you. We're laughing at you, nigga. We're laughing at you and ridiculous shit. I gave you the truth. I asked it the first time. I asked it the first time. Okay, then that I thought wasn't good, good enough. Good. I thought it was giggly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 First of all, I'm the you least sensitive person. You know, I'm just not going to play about certain stuff. You know what I'm I'm just not going to play about certain stuff. I'm not playing because I'm giggling about your opinion. <laughs> he said, wait, you just said, I'm the least sensitive, but I get mad when you be the giggling about what I'm talking about. <laughs> no, I said I don't play. I said get mad. I said I don't play about that. Okay, but okay, you so said keep you ain't sensitive. I'm not playing. <laughs> well, so if you ain't, I, I asked you a question. Be, okay, that's right. I'm not sensitive, and but I don't right play about say, it. I don't know. That's all I'm saying. That's what you no, it's not. Said. If I sit there and say I don't play you about it, that has nothing to do with being sensitive. That just certain you things you just don't play about. <laughs> I gave you the right answer. <laughs> you gave me a bunch of bullshit, man. No, I didn't. Okay, prove me wrong. But love be shame, prove, prove shame me your ass. Prove me wrong. <laughs> prove me wrong. We gave you the same answer. Prove I me wrong. I asked you, and I'm paraphrasing, what would the criteria be for getting into heaven? I just gave it to you, man. What is the criteria if it's before Jesus? What what would your answer you be? You won't even let me finish what the hell I'm saying. <laughs> and it's my damn shit. Stop that giggling. I <laughs> asked you, before the coming of Jesus, uh-huh. which was 198,000 years uh-huh. after Adam and Eve, All right. what was the criteria for getting into heaven? The criteria after Jesus came was believe in Jesus and you in there. Before Jesus came, what did you have to believe in? Did you have to do or believe to get into heaven? You started talking about Prince and P. Diddy and shit. <laughs> tying, okay. tying ropes around you and pulling you out. I'm exaggerating. Well, well, you know, but you Prince went off on do that, right. <laughs> Which is fine because, like I tell you, man, and I'm no, I'm no, you know, I just be asking shit. I've asked about 10 Preachers that I that I believe in, and they I didn't mean, give I you believe, that one, huh? They didn't give you the the All ledge of the other limits? nine or, or ten of them have told me, DZ, I don't know. You oh, the wow. only one that came up with this bullshit. I can't help what they learn from. No, that's no, in the Bible. No, no, no. You're that. the only one. I'm asking you. I'm gonna ask you one more time. Before Jesus came, after Jesus came, <laughs> if you believe in Jesus. You in there, right? Mm-hmm. John three sixteen. If you believe in Jesus, you in there. Mm-hmm. What was the criteria for getting into heaven before Jesus came, which was, according to science, a hundred and ninety eight thousand years of humanity? Right. So, if you're saying those hundreds of thousand years, we're gonna go by the book. In chronological order, from from Genesis, leading all the way up to leading all the way up to Matthew. Before then, you had the Levites and you had the, the the tribes of Judah, and what they had to do was send in a purified priest, and they would send a purified a, man, a guy that was with a, a, a priest that supposedly <laughs> that was reading re, that was reading the scriptures. Yeah, all right, who supposedly was for the people, and then the people would bring 
whether it be a ram or a dove, you had a sin, you had a, a sin offering and a love offering, and that priest would go in there, and he would petition for the people of God, and if he was not pure, and he'd have a bell, if he was not pure, um, he would die, and they would pull him out, uh, and they would pull him out in the place of holies, and then if he was, he would go in there, petition for the people, and then that would be it. Is it me? I'm just saying. I'm just it's trying not. to figure out. And I guess it went up until and the, the point pe- they died. And the people, it was a, and you the did yearly offerings, in, and they had to live in that repentance yeah. of the offering that was made. And had to live in that repentance from moving forward. Yearly. Forward is this, so. It's the same difference as with Jesus. Like we believe that Jesus is God's only begotten Son. And he gave his life for all of our sins. We believe in that. So we live in that and we do our best to live a righteous life. What Brian is saying before Jesus, that we had to make the priest would make the holy priest, supposed to be the holy priest, would make the sacrifice on behalf of the people. And that was the criteria for the people to get in and get into heaven. So okay, so if I'm here, if I'm sacrifice. here before somebody Jesus, else had to make the sacrifice if I'm on, on earth your before behalf. Jesus, I you can't weren't. believe in Jesus because he ain't been here. Mm-hmm. So how y'all? When I get to the but you believe in gates, God? I believe in God. But I can't yeah, believe in Jesus. Jesus. Right. So right. I'm tell, I'm asking you, what is going to determine whether I get into heaven or not? After Jesus, the determination. John 3.16 is if you believe in Jesus. Before Jesus, 198,000 years between Adam and Eve and Jesus, but you can't. what you would determine on, whether I would get into heaven you or not? Depended on, on, I mean, you depended on the holy <laughs> priest to, to go in the the the, 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 let, me, the, the let me say yeah, this. Thank you. And make the sacrifice on your behalf. Why would I repent. believe that? Because he was closest to God. He was Supposed pure to God. Why would I believe Supposed that? Supposedly. Supposedly. Because it's your belief. Hold it's on. still your belief. So, Jay, let me say this. Supposedly. Supposedly. You can't be before Jesus because they say in the beginning was the word. And the word was with God. And Jesus it wasn't was the Jesus. word. Jesus wasn't. Now, but there's Jesus a fact. Jesus was the word. Down, Jesus wasn't, God had Jesus wasn't in the beginning. The word. Yeah. No, in the it wasn't. Was, that's, that's what they break it down. There's it a chronological, there historical documentation of when Jesus came. Jesus in fact, people that ain't quished. Christians, there's no debate about whether, I mean among sensible people, exactly. there's no debate about whether Jesus came. The debate is whether he was son of God or not. So, who's so in the don't fire tell with me that Jesus was in who's the in days the, of who's Adam in the, and Eve. Who, he and, wasn't. And, who, who's and, in the fire? Who's in the fire with Shadrach, Meshach, Humankind Who's had, in the fire? Humankind had existed 198,000 right, they was already years. here when Jesus who got Who was in the Jesus fire came. with Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego? Who was in the fire? Uh, Coolio. Okay. <laughs> I'm just saying. I don't take my word for who's in the fire. Because it said the fourth one is So y'all tell me who's in the fire then. Oh, if Jesus, was if it the wasn't Jesus, who was in the fire? We know who was in the oh. fire. Okay, so how, then, then you can't sit there the and say, then you can't sit there and say that God. Jesus was 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 not here a thousand or some years ago. Listen, nigga. Listen to me. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. I, mean, I get what you're saying, but just tell form. me. He Jesus came. At so a his certain image time. was in the fire. There, are you arguing that Jesus did not come when he came? I'm not arguing at all. He came down. He came down in the in the flesh, but he was oh, here yeah, in the yeah, beginning. In physical form. And only after that was it declared that if you believe in him, you'll get into heaven and have everlasting life. This is a simple question. So, and it's all right to say you don't know. That's not true, though. I do know. You just ain't accepting the answer I'm giving you. Because it doesn't make sense. How does it not? Okay. That's when, Brian, mean, that's when you go to God. That. On, that, that's I don't know how go, it don't make sense because Brian, to me it makes sense. Go, Brian, that's when you go to God on D.C.'s behalf and ask God to give D.C. the revelation that you have. Don't be upset, but Father Lord that. Jesus, I pray at 3 o'clock in the morning, pray on D.C.'s behalf <laughs> that he get the revelation. <laughs> I mean, listen, all I'm saying is... If I hit some windows and shit screeching at my house tonight... <laughs> no, nah, I'll do that. I'll do that. I'm just so glad that, you know, everybody just got this let expertise it go. on it. Just let it go, man. Mm-hmm. I, hey, look, Rem, what do you think about trans transgender uh, people playing in the... Transgender boys, they used to be boys, now they're transgender playing in the... I know, Richard, we got to wrap it up. And now they're playing cashers. What's happening, man? 
Now they're playing in the girls' sports. I do not agree with that. I do not agree with... Which part? Bo- Which I do mean? not agree with boys that become girls playing in a girls' sport. It is not fair. I thought y'all want equal right. Hold on. First of all, I'm a woman. So I did not say I want to play against a man. I ain't say that. <laughs> well, I don't think I, I, that. Women be talking about they saying they deserve the equal pay in soccer and all that. Equal pay in <laughs> basketball and the ball ain't even the same. You know, a woman with basketball is smaller than a man. Yeah, it is because our hands are smaller. It's oh, that's why. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes I, I, I think it'd be a lot easier to me. To me, if you can make something, if you can do certain sports in Olympics and make it an Olympic sport, I just don't see why you just won't just do your transgender sports. Yes, right. make a transgender right, sport. Because you got because in the Olympics right now, flag football is going to be an Olympic game. Um, so when you Spades add that, Spades is about to be an Olympic game. Well, that'd what? Be crazy. Spades. It could be, but Frisbee I don't know. Frisbee is know. about dice. What'd you say, Spades? Spades. Oh, shooting dice is about to be an Olympic I don't, game. I don't Let me know. tell you something, Frisbee man. Frisbee is about to be an Olympic they game. They come with all these games when black people start dominating different games. They start coming with some games that they know you niggas know can't, you can't play. play. Fri- yeah. Frisbee yeah. is about to be Bean, a uh, what they call a hopscotch. No, no, real talk. <laughs> Frisbee is about to be a Olympic sport. What's the one they on ice? And they rub the thing and make and the they ball slide go. the damn thing. Yeah, and they what? Got, what? It's, yeah like it's a, a ball. No, it's what not they ice call hockey. It? I want to say rub it. No, it's not ice hockey. What you like, call it? Rugby. It's a no, ball. No, you slide that thing. I know Shuffle what you call it. Shuffleboard. Uh uh-uh, uh. You, you, it's ice. And three guys. I can't guys, think of it. I know what you're saying, because they this. do like this and sweep the ice or something like that. That ain't, that ain't, that ain't, that ain't a bit more a sport, than the, uh, sport than the man on the fucking moon, but man. But it's, it's yeah. huge, though. Like people, I don't know how it got to be huge. But See, I feel like, Let me tell you something, man. They're coming up with all these sports that abandon physical uh, expertise because black folk have dominated those that yeah. do. You watch basketball, NBA, NCAA. Tennis. Don't dominated by so black they keep golf. The goal so what they do, what they did, the what they post. do, black folks start taking over tennis, so they come with pickleball. Mm-hmm. <laughs> where you ain't got to move. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And you come up with that uh, that ice shit y'all were talking about. Yeah. <laughs> That's just, in the limit. Curling there. Curling. 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 Yeah, curling. curling. I couldn't they think come of with, curling. They come curling. with chess. Yeah. Right. They, come, like they got a man now. They can play chess, and he can't even. He a paraplegic. Y'all see that? He just moving the. Yeah. He moving the damn thing with his mind. <laughs> they still got snowboard. I like though. chess. They gonna have that for a while. We just ain't gonna do that. They right. keep yeah. moving snowboard. the goalposts. Yeah. Yeah. But like you said, skiing, and then they <laughs> yeah. went to snowboard. Yeah. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So, yeah, we ain't gonna do that. But yeah, they got um, shooting dice this year. Yeah, what? shooting dice. Yeah, they actually gonna do it on the corner. Um, this year at the Olympics. <laughs> yeah. pool jamming. She the damn lie. I know I ain't going to oh, It's the corner right. they pick. She can't even pick up mouth. Look at her mouth. Look at her mouth. Her mouth trembling. I'm, I'm in it. I'm in it. I, I know your I tail. Know. I, I, I felt your tail. I felt your tail. Man, somebody from Nickel Rock is going to bust you up. But the transgenders, they're transgenders right in hell. They want to compete with the girl. No, the they go, yeah, they want to compete, compete with the girls. Why you want to like compete with the girls? Go sense. compete. Yeah. Go compete with the boys. Yeah. Go. Yeah. Well, that's not even fair, JJ. Why it's not? Because it's transgender. You can be transgender. Correct me if I'm wrong. If you a boy, and then turn to a girl. But what if you're a girl turned to a boy? You're still transgender, right? I right. just... Right. So they shouldn't have to complete, compete. So it, it would have to be transgender boys... Play against the other transgender boys. Should do their own league. Should do their own right. league. Transgender girls. Just reverse back to what it should be. I, the first I just way. don't listen. All of that is is too much for me. If you were born a male, then you need to play in a ma- with the males. Exactly. And if you were born a female, then you can play with the females. Yeah, I, I, I don't, I don't care see that no you can dress like I mean, a man. you can be a you can be a female that likes little pussy, but you ain't have to be. Uh, <laughs> I just think, you know, when man, you when you when you're, I mean? when you're a girl and you got your daughter or niece out there training <laughs> and she doing all that, then Shut you got this dude going to come over there because he identify <laughs> and just dominate. No, it, it, it just, uh, it's I not fair. You, I told y'all <laughs> before, when my I son wrestled, when my son wrestled, it was a girl <laughs> that was, 10. she wasn't transgender and she just wrestled with the boys. Right. 
And one boy lost the match because he was afraid. And I told my son, I said, uh-uh, yeah. put her down. Yeah. Put her down and her purse. That's easy to say. That's easy to say. Well, he put her down. A girl, a girl. He didn't hurt her. He didn't hurt her, but he put her. He put his. Oh, I always want to stay championship. I wrestled in, I wrestled in high yeah. school and college. Like this boy. Mm-hmm. And I, when I, I tried to put a nigga down. I tried to put a nigga down. And I, I would not feel comfortable trying to put. Well, her my son put her down. And I told him put her down. <laughs> I sure did. <laughs> put her down. <laughs> did not Prince put her down? The uh, other boy, he lost. And everybody was like, oh my God, and it was mixed feelings. And when my son went up, I said, and the parents, look, what? Put her down. He didn't hurt her. Right. But he put her down. Yeah, you Get your tail up out of here. I would have hurt him. <laughs> <laughs> I Get tried your to tail up out of here. I tried to mess up. Because how bad do you look if a girl beats you? That's what I'm saying. Yeah, you got to do it. I I'm tried to break a neck, man. Yeah, do it. And I'm not saying it just to be on, on the show and be like, oh, no. I told, put her down. Put her down. Well, you saw what Put Ice Cube down. did. Ice Cube is... Put her down. Put her down. Ice, Ice Cube is going to make it hard for Caitlin Clark to go to the WNBA. Yeah. He offered her $5 million. Yeah. That's going to be... It's going to be hard for her to just go to the WNBA with $5 million stand that you play three on three. The money thing out of control now. Anyway, college, you can leave and go play for another college. I mean, you yeah. can get money in high school now. Yeah, they're going to they gonna have to curtail and stop that. Do something. It's getting out of hand. I'm, re- I'm reiterating my. Uh, Excuse me. I'm reiterating my proclamation. If they're gonna allow these boys, which they are doing now in high school and college, to get uh, endorsement deals, Charges. they ought to set aside a certain mm-hmm. percentage that has to go to HBCUs. Yep. Mm. Yeah. And the, otherwise, the HBCUs are not going to be able to right, compete. Survive, right, survive. Exactly. Well, don't, do you think that that's a strategy that they're, that they're doing Heck yeah. to do just what you just said? I hadn't thought about degree. that, JJ. Mm-hmm. That's why they pulled Deion so fast. I tell you what. Mm-hmm. Th- that's why they pulled Deion so fast. We think women ain't got no idea. <laughs> mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's why they pulled Dion so fast. Dion was here. Comes sister JJ. <laughs> Dion made HBC the first sense. time to outsell SEC games. So if you outsell the SEC games without it being a classic, so if you outsell them, then what? People going, and then you got money. Then if you got one number one recruit go, and all of them can't go to JSU, then of course the other ones will start going to these different HBCUs. And so now, if you got the best athletes going to those, where the TV gonna go? And Dion in two years had game day at Jackson State. If everybody's got to play catch up at the um, at the HBCU level, it's only a matter of time some of these athletes are going to go to them. So if the best athletes are going there, where the television going to go? It's going to go there. So right. they came in. Hey, come on over to Colorado. Mm-hmm. We can't even let we can't let this get started. Mm-hmm. Let's give you five million mm-hmm. and come to the lowest of us. Mm-hmm. And then what happens is if he doesn't succeed. You know how we are. Mm-hmm. If he doesn't succeed, no HBCU is going to accept him because they right. can't trust him. Right. Yeah. If you do, we benefit and mm-hmm. we still ain't going to keep you forever. Mm-hmm. And then if you don't win like we want you to, we'll put you over there in a power five They're as an assistant chess. coach. They're yeah. playing chess while we're playing chess. Yeah. I hate that. I hate that. I mean, mm-hmm. I, I hope Dion can be successful, but I just think where he's what, at is going to be hard. What I will also add is at a minimum, I'm gonna call Dion. these I'm gonna try to children play. should be required to take financial classes. That's my opinion. You give a young person all this kind of money, they should be required to take some type of financial class. I'm with you, I'm with you but what they need to do is financial, the financial classes advisors. And, and pool dancing. Well, y'all have to understand, these. most of these people, that are, these young people that are getting money are grown. So uh, they need to, too. Most of, most well, let me tell you something, they, they, Cookie. They y'all grown. been watching the tournament? Y'all been watching the college tournament? I swear I've been to God, watching some, of them, some of them niggas 42 years old. I I've been watching, yeah. <laughs> Come on, man. Yeah, yeah, huh? yeah. Them some March old Madness. ass son of bitches San, students. San Diego, San Diego, like they got about two and about 38. Oh, them niggas old as motherfuckers. They got about man. 38, man. You know. What can I say? Yeah. Did y'all see the white boy last night? Reeves. Cream, Cream. Yeah. They, they call him. No, no. He what plays for Indiana State. So, you know, they got the NIT. And they yeah. had the quarterfinals, and this is this white guy. They call him Cream instead of Kareem. He called him Cream Abdul Jabbar. <laughs> and but he balling, he wear goggles and everything, just like Kareem. <laughs> and he just got a basic 
super fun to I've been enjoying him. Yeah, look, man, he's been doing it. All right, give said. us a pick, man. Huh? Look what you just said. You what said he, you got the glasses and everything like Kareem. Yeah. But y'all yeah. had a, a conversation earlier about Beyonce and Erica Badu mm -hmm. having the same stuff and bringing oh, it back. Oh, shit. Yeah, but I'm just Come saying. On, I'm just pointing it out. I mean, Come I'm on, saying, you, but I'm just saying that's on Erica Badu for pointing. Don't out. be apologizing. You know, I'm not accusing don't, you. Don't, don't yeah. I'm just bringing it back. Don't yeah. be apologizing. He, putting your foot in his ass. You, you know what I'm saying? Put it in my Kareem, he, you was excited about him having the glasses on, like Kareem and all of that. Because I'm just going by who gave him the name. But he still copied some shit, right? Oh, he just can't see. He had. Well, speak, yeah. well, speaking I mean, of, he had speaking, of right. speaking of copy, we have a uh, girl, Brad. Did I say it right? Bernard, he's a big fan of the show, and he wants to know our take on Obama visiting the White House to help Biden win. He needs some help. Biden needs some <laughs> help. Somebody need to tell him Biden been dead since September. Biden. <laughs> Biden needs some help. God Obama, bless. Obama, Biden is dead. That's an AI. God bless using. Barack Obama. God bless America. God bless USA, who rated 23rd in all of the world, all the countries. It's 100 and uh, 195 countries. Mm -hmm. I used to know all of them. 195 countries in the world, and they did a, a rating the other day of the happiest people in the countries. America dropped from number one to 23. I bet we did. Who's number one now? That's a good question. We know it ain't Ukraine. <laughs> Damn, Joe sure ain't Africa. Oh, Lord, you're praying. I, I feel sorry for y'all. I, I, I feel sorry for y'all. I, I think it's Decatur. I feel sorry. <laughs> Might be Alabama, boy. Might be Jamaica. Man, they, Birmingham, they said Birmingham is the most obese number city in the world. Country in the world. Right, really yeah, right. Ain't nothing country in the world. Ain't nothing more country than Alabama. <laughs> what did you say, man? They said Birmingham is the most obese city in the United States. Obese. Birmingham? Yeah, they, they said 87 percent of people are overweight. They got barbecue. That's down crazy. There. Wow. Number one. Memphis number two. Don't y'all get too happy. Yeah. Memphis number two. Memphis number two. But you know, I was told don't go. You know, even even too. the oh, parameters of obesity are are racist. Like I'm, I'm six feet. That's I was six saying. one. I'm uh, six feet now. Cause we have a. But I'm supposed to be like 176 pounds. I mean, I don't know how that's possible. That's, that's white people said. Yeah. yeah, I don't know how that's possible. Yeah, we built six one, one hundred and seventy six pounds. Out. That's I ain't six one no more. Yeah, I was we, six we, one. We I'm about six feet head. now. Five eleven and three quarters. I think what doctor told me. That still ain't healthy. If I'm you get shrunk. sick at one hundred seventy six pounds, you lose any type of weight, man. You ain't gonna hardly be here. I don't. Yeah. I, I don't. I don't. But, I don't but according to the books, they say I should weigh like one hundred seventy something pounds. Bump that. That's Mike. You like. 200 pounds of weight, player. I I'm think it's also awesome where we put our weight. <laughs> <laughs> like where we put, where we put. We, black too, people are built different. He said it's it's pounds of where weight. We, uh, and where you know why? You know why we're built different? Because during the days of slavery, they bred us and they put us, they would put the big woman, the muscular man together trying to make a dinosaur. A big slave. But what about, right. what, about make a big what about before slave, slavery right. though? DC, huh? we were built different before slavery. Well, I don't women know about in that. Africa, maybe DC. I don't know about that. I don't know about that because they stayed yeah. in shape in Africa, chasing them lions and shit. <laughs> you know what? Oh my god! When they come over here and started sitting on the ass. <laughs> so what you think we need to do? Let go some lions. <laughs> Man. Let's but anyway, lions. America twenty third. Uh, Rank 23rd, man, on the list of happiest countries. It could it be says worse. says something about us. We'll we need right. to tighten up. In the world. Ain't that something? They didn't yeah. survey nobody that smoked weed. And they still say, <laughs> they still say we the richest, which goes to show you, can money buy you happiness? Right. Mm. Rich really? and happy America. I, I, money I, can I, make I, you rich, but God money makes you I know happy. a lot of depressed friends of mine that have far more money. I don't have a whole lot of money, but. But you be pressed to find a nigga happier than me. I know that's mm. right, DC. That's, hey, can I say one more thing? We're going to go back to sports. No. Why they attack Tom Brady? <laughs> 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 Why they attack Tom Brady for saying that he believed Giselle was cheating on him? Uh, who attacked him? Giselle said she wasn't TMZ. cheating. She said she wasn't, but Tom said she was cheating. Well, then that's his Tom feel. If he, be, if he feel as though she was cheating on him, 
Then yeah. that's his belief, and I'm quite sure he have a reason for. She said she wasn't cheating. She's just trying to learn karate or and whatever. <laughs> and she was taking wrestling class. But he felt something. <laughs> yeah, but she TMZ said, attacked Tom me. Brady like a mug yesterday. Tom Brady be clean really? too, boy. They attacked. If you ever want to see a ten thousand dollars suit, Tom Brady and King uh, over there in England, them niggas be wearing ten thousand dollars suit. Suit look flawless. Uh, Oh, they be wearing ten thousand. I know ten thousand yeah. dollars. Yeah. But anyway, yeah, she uh, now she in a relationship with the, with, with karate, the, instructor. With the karate, karate instructor. instructor. So, so what do you do when your spouse says, "Hey, I feel as though you're you, you're cheating on me." And you, you shoot know the that, motherfucker. You, so, <laughs> so if she wasn't and you know cheating, that, and you know okay, that so you're look, not. If she wasn't cheating. Then how she get so fond of the karate instructor so fast? Like he felt the chemistry. A week after, a week after they're so men should be there to answer was, that question. To me, y'all the do kids were comfortable, comfortable around the guy when they went on vacation. She went on vacation with the guy a week after they got a divorce. Right. So is it she was out there taking tai chi. You both be you both be neutral, tai chi. Tai chi. Uh, really? I'm rocking with Tom. What kind of counselor is you, man? Hey, she gave me the orders. She gave me all the signs that it was she was dealing with that guy. So does it matter now, though? Uh, not nah, well. I guess to Tom, because I got agree. Tom with you never said anything. I got agree with him on Tom that. Tom never said anything. And I wonder why Thank Tom is saying it now. Like I, I don't. I, I gotta agree with him. Yeah. I just wonder why Tom is saying it now. Because women don't fall on, on dick in a week. They just don't. Oh, not like regular that. women. Not uh, like that. Oh, I not, think, not regular I think women. Definitely. <laughs> <laughs> not regular women. <laughs> not in love. Oh, <laughs> they I'm fall on it, but not bringing in love. Bringing the kids oh, there. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, so, so again, what, what, again, what do you do? I ain't no sex professional, but I stayed at a Holiday Inn last night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> You've been listening to This Race. I'm D.C. Curry. I'm Sister J.J. I'm Brian Harper. <laughs> I'm Cookie Hall and just happened to pop in. Oh, thank you. Make sure y'all see my movie, Too Crazy on Another Level, streaming on Tubi and Amazon Prime. What's the other one? Um, it's coming May 7th. Men Pray 2 on Tubi. And Men Pray 2. It's God a good movie. bless you. We'll holler. <laughs> <laughs>